Hello gardeners, it is Lauren from Till and Trowel here on this hot day out at the garden plot. Um, it's actually Friday morning. Um, didn't have a lot planned today, so I came out early in the morning. Well, relatively early. It's uh, a little after nine, I think. Yeah, 20 after nine. And um, it it's, was a killer hot day yesterday. It's gonna be a killer hot day today. And I figured my plants needed some water. So I'm doing that and I am, um, whoa, sorry about that. And I'm doing my chores today rather than tomorrow. It's gonna be hot again tomorrow. So um, go ahead and doing my chores and I thought I'd show you some of the things I'm working on. Okay, so here's the plot. I got the water going on the tomatoes and um, recently got an eye watch. One of those, uh, well, it's my husband's hand-me-down. Um, and I've been using the timer feature. I can say, go for five minutes, and then that reminds me to move the water. I'm doing a trickle-type watering on, well, relatively trickle, on the tomatoes. I just have the hose going there at a slow rate so it'll sink in and get deep. And with eight tomatoes, eight times five minutes, it's gonna take me 40 minutes to water all of these. So, uh, my timer is done. So, let's go ahead and move the water. Woo. Tomatoes like um, deep watering rather than frequent watering. And since it's gonna be hot and breezy, they really need the extra support today. Can't do that every hot, breezy day but uh can do sometimes so hold on one second while i stop the timer and repeat it there's a repeat button how about that that's kind of handy so um i pulled out my spinach and i've had this um empty now for about a week and one of them is going to be swiss chard i'm going to go ahead and put it in um the soil is rather crumbly and chunky so i'm hoping to break it up and smooth it out a bit um, one thing I did want to show you was my lettuce. Okay, so it's going to be like 99 degrees today or something like that. And that's really hot for lettuce. Um, but these guys are, well, when it's hot, they want to bolt. In other words, send up a shoot and produce some seeds. So I am pulling out some of these lettuces and my lucky neighbors are going to get some lettuce. Um, how do I know it's thinking about bolting? I don't know if you could see it in this picture, but the center part here is starting to get a little bit taller. And when they bolt, they send up a shoot and there are flowers on the top, you know, it comes out of the middle here. And um, so I don't want to uh, have it bolt. I want to go ahead and pull these lettuce, um, pull these heads of lettuce out and <laughs> they're really impressive. Oh, I made a uh, freebie for phone wallpaper out of some of my lettuces because they were so beautiful. Um, go to my website, tillandtrowel.com, and you can download it for free. Um, I might be able to pull out the rest of the carrots on this half of this row. I put these in first, and so they're quite mature. I've pulled out a few so far, and they've been pretty good. Why don't I pull one out? So you can actually see... So I know it's getting close to ready. Let me see here. Can you see that? Yeah. Um, the little shoulder of the carrot is starting to poke up. So I like to wiggle it to loosen it. So I'm kind of going in a circular fashion. Pull it out and, ooh, nice carrot. Very cool. So I will get a number of carrots today. If I pull them all out, I will have some space for onions. That is my other chore today. Planting some of my onions. I'm hoping it'll work. Some places have told me that onions um, should be started in the spring, which is probably ideal, but I didn't have space in the spring. Um, I will put, pluck a few beets as well. Yeah, this guy's definitely ready. Look at that. You can tell that beets are ready to harvest when they start popping up above the ground, like this guy. I mean, there isn't much there. <laughs> I got, these plants are kind of little. I don't know if they'll fully develop. 
Um, there are a couple others that are looking like they're ready. Can you see this right here? Oh, so that's part of sharpening one's observation skills. Oh, here's a big fat one. It's not ready yet because it's not um, it's not popping out, but you can see the top of it here. There you go. All right. So um, the peppers are starting to produce some flowers, but peppers are a hot season uh, veggie, so they aren't really quite ready yet. They need a drink too, for sure. Ah, uh, this is my favorite time of year at the garden. Um, there's just so much to see and do and you're getting harvest and there's things to plant and there's maintenance to do. Um, I love coming up here. Yes, I have my sunscreen on and I just realized I didn't put my bug spray on. I better do that before I forget. All right, I will wrap up my little video here and happy gardening to you.